Hi, I'm Jan Stoneman. I'm a solutions architect. I have done all the AWS certifications and I just did my fifth uh, Azure exam that I passed and it was the AZ500. Uh, that's for the, let's see, it's called the Microsoft Security Engineer Associate uh, certification. And uh, since I just took it, I thought I'd share some thoughts on how it went. Uh, so I was a little tired when I took it at 8.30 a.m. on a Saturday morning. And um, what actually helped me stay focused was using the whiteboard feature that the Pearson View app provides, which lets you draw stuff, but also just write stuff. So I wrote out my thoughts as I worked through the problems and that helped me stay on track uh, with my focus. And then a surprise in the exam was, um, unlike the other three or, uh, unlike the other four exams I've taken, this one didn't have any other multiple choice questions after the lab was done. The exam was just over after the lab. Uh, so that was a little surprise, but um, no harm. Um, I, I might have taken a little bit more time on the lab had I known there's nothing after that. Um, I guess I could have figured that out by looking at the amount of questions left and then the amount of questions in the lab, but that wasn't on my radar because I always thought there would be more questions after the lab. Anyway, that's a small detail. And then I prepared for the exam by having the Linux Academy app and the Udemy app downloaded on my phone and listening to the lectures on Linux Academy and the lectures on Udemy. Uh, the, if you type in AZ500 into Udemy, you'll see the course by Nick Collier is the top one. And that's the one I listened to. And um, I also used the flashcards on the Linux Academy app, which really helped. Um, but otherwise, the, there's also the labs on the Linux Academy course, which are helpful and the microsoft.com forward slash learn. Um, but all of those combined were uh, really good preparation. And uh, actually, unlike the AZ203 and the, uh, the 301 exams, I felt like I was a bit more prepared for this one uh, with the help of those materials. So hope that helped.